I'm Helen Wallace. Um, I became interested in European integration as a student at the College of Europe in Bruges a long time ago in 1967. I went on to become an academic specialising in European integration, always with an enlargement dimension but not only. So I've always had my fingers sort of tangling in the advisory circles around the European Commission. The European Union has changed a lot from the European community of six that I first studied and it's become, I think in a very healthy way, much more representative of the European continent as a whole. So from my point of view, but I would say this being British, wouldn't I, to expand to bring in other countries brought new ideas, new dimensions. I mean, European citizens benefit because the European Union provides an insurance system to anchor stability and prosperity. All of us, in whichever country, in whatever walk of life, benefit from that insurance premium. And although the last decade's been difficult for the European Union, it's not been because of the internal effects of the arrival of those new member states, which for me is very encouraging. Statistically, there is hardly any significant negative impact on British citizens from migrants from other European Union countries. This is very carefully researched evidence. It's not very well believed by the general public. One of the reasons why I've enjoyed being a Europeanist is that it's an opportunity, it provides an opportunity to get to know other European countries and to understand their distinctive cultures. It means that I can live and work in other European countries easily, um, which is, it's been a pleasure to be able to do. And I've learnt a lot and always have things to learn from conversations with friends and colleagues from other countries in order to compare and contrast our different ways of looking at things. So being able to be part of a wider European family pushes me to be extrovert and more open-minded. <laughs>